Hello, this is the code ready version of the command design pattern. Now, the idea of the command design pattern is to be able to create one command that can be carried out by multiple concrete classes. Now, the command pattern design pattern example is the manager who says work. In the main class, we have one manager instance, and the manager has workers, actually employees. And these employees, these workers, are different kind of employees. One for human resources, one for programmer, one for security officer. And these are all stored inside the manager for our testing purposes. And manager says work to all of his employees. If we run the program, resourcing humans is HR, programmer is coding, and security officer is keeping your ass safe. And the heart is the message here that the manager is giving to the uh, actually employees, actually. Yes. Let's take a look at the implementation classes, HR, programmer, and security officer. They are similar, very similar to each other. And they all implement one unique in interface called worker and the work method inside the worker interface actually is the command in our design pattern. Every single implementation of the worker has to you know implement the work method inside therefore our command has been unified so that our command can be unified. We have a simple interface for worker and the idea of this interface is to be able to produce more than one different implement more than one implementations for worker HR programmer security officer or whatever kind of implementation you create in the future you will be able to add them inside the manager and the manager will be able to tell them to work without changing any line of code here now we don't have to store the array list, the list of workers inside the manager, but for our testing purposes, we would like to be able to call the work method for more than one workers. So we have workers here, we are adding workers here, and we're calling the unified command work under the manager. So if I want to give the manager to work the command of work, he will be able to call the work method of the employees, the workers within the class here. So to summarize, we would like to be able to give one command to multiple actors, multiple concrete classes, and we would like to be able to call them from one single unified center. That's all for the command design pattern. I'll see you in the next implementation video. Thank you.